before you start a new Premiere Pro project, I recommend that you first create a project folder. This is where you'll save the Premiere Pro project file, as well as the other media files that you'll be using. This includes the video files, audio clips, images, and other files that you'll be working with. Keeping them all in one location makes it easier to manage your files. To start a new project, launch the Premiere Pro application, then click on New Project. Choose your project folder. Give your project a name and click OK. You'll then be prompted to create a new sequence. Think of a sequence as a container where you'll be putting all of your clips together to make your video project. You can choose from any of the available presets, which are grouped in different folders. You've got the DV, HDV, and Mobile and Devices presets to name a few. Or you can also create your own custom settings by clicking on the General tab. You can change the editing mode, video frame size, audio sampling rate, and other properties. If you're not very familiar with these settings, you can go back to the presets. If your video footage was captured from a mini DV camcorder, then you can choose one of the DV presets. If you're working with high definition video clips, then you can choose an HDV preset instead. Take a look at the video files that you'll be using for your project and see which of these presets best matches your files. You'll see the preset description here. If your video files don't match any of the presets perfectly, it's fine. Just choose the one that most closely matches your clips. Once you've chosen a sequence preset, you can give your sequence a new name, or you can keep the default sequence name. Then click OK to create your new project. 